First Alert Weather with meteorologist Eric Weglars. Happy Monday morning. The time right now is 614. Also, Merry Christmas yeah. Eve. I can't believe it's already Christmas Eve. I've been saying it all morning, but yeah, time flies. I was thinking about this a couple days ago, too. I mean, it feels like yesterday was the middle of summer, mm -hmm. not figuratively, but you know. <laughs> yeah, well, also, you know, we had a story about how Christmas Eve is also National Eggnog Day. Are you a fan? Oh, yes. You are. Oh, I, I love, am not I love a fan. Eggnog. What? Yep. This is a crime. <laughs> this is absolutely a crime. I'm eggnog not a big is fan. so good. A good day to, you know, I guess sit by the fireplace yeah. and drink eggnog. Are you a hot chocolate fan? I am a hot chocolate fan. A good fan. day to do that too. It's cold. <laughs> so, I mean, you may want something warm. Hot chocolate, coffee, something along Whatever those lines. Whatever it is. <laughs> yeah. Eggnog, if you're a fan of eggnog like I am. Alice, I still can't believe that. All right. So, if you're a fan of snow, we also have some snow to talk about this morning as well. Mainly coming off of the Great Lakes. And this is one of the disturbances we can see on Storm Tracker here this morning. Coming off of Lake Superior, Lake Michigan, this is going to drift towards the south and the east this afternoon, and more snow will begin to work its way from that. The second is off uh, the southern New England coastline. That'll kick out of here later on today as well. 19 right now in Messina. This is why it's uh, a little bit on the colder side. 23 in Burlington, 19 in Montpelier, the middle and upper 20s for much of southwestern Vermont and the forecast for today has a lot of clouds. We may get a hint of sunshine or two and then a few more snow showers as we head throughout the afternoon. Things turn around quite nicely for tomorrow. So as you're unwrapping presents, plenty of sunshine. It's cold though and it stays cold for a couple of days. We will be talking about a bit of an icy mess for the end of the week here in the form of some snow and rain. But for today, snow showers, mainly across southwestern Vermont at 10 o'clock this morning. Notice a few of these are starting to come off of Lake Ontario. And then as the afternoon progresses, I think the snow showers become more numerous. But notice the fine line here. Anywhere south and west of Burlington is the best shot to see some accumulating snowfall. And that continues through this evening before we dry things up tonight. And Christmas Day, of course, features plenty of sunshine with a few afternoon clouds mixed in as well. So again, the best chance for accumulating snowfalls across portions of the Tri Lakes into southwest Western Vermont, one to two inches of snow potentially across the higher summits, but just enough to make things pretty white as we head into Christmas morning. So 26 today in Plattsburgh, same deal in Saranac Lake, the upper 20s in Burlington, 31 in Middlebury, 33 in Lebanon. And here's that icy mess we're expecting on Friday. Notice that we get enough cold air the next couple of days where it starts off as snow and a wintry mix of sleet and freezing rain. And then as we get enough warm air in here, I think that we see a change over to rain as we head into Friday afternoon. So for tomorrow, it's plenty of sunshine. Temperatures in the middle 20s. We'll go to the freezing mark on Wednesday. It's a pretty dull day. We'll get a lot of clouds and a few peaks of sunshine in there. Wednesday afternoon, Thursday, any clouds give way to sun. We're in the upper 20s. And then look at this. We go to the middle 40s on Friday. Any snow and sleet changes to rain pretty quickly. And then we cool things down again. Another shot of cold air smashes in for the weekend. Look at this. New Year's Eve, a high of 18. Nighttime lows are in the single digits before we moderate in the middle 20s for the middle of the following week.